The next live movie theater transmission will be on Saturday, March 16th, with Francesca da Rimini, Riccardo Zandonai's opera inspired by Dante's Inferno. It stars soprano Eva Maria Vesbrook in the title role of the woman trapped in a fateful triangle. Here's a clip from yesterday's final dress rehearsal. Ava Maria Vesbrook is with me now. Hello, Ava. Hi, Eric. How are you? I'm well. So wonderful to see you. You just had your final dress rehearsal for Francesca yesterday, and it opens Monday. Are you excited? I'm super excited. Absolutely. <laughs> the last time the Met staged Francesca da Rimini was in 1986. We just played an excerpt from the second act battle scene in which we heard some of your beautiful and dramatic singing. Thanks. Since our audience may not be familiar with this piece, can you tell us a little bit about the story? Uh, it's a really uh, wonderful story. It's about Francesca who is uh, married um, to uh, Malatesta, Gianciotto Malatesta, and she thinks she's going to be married to Paolo, who she meets in the first act, and she falls so in love with this guy. But she wakes up after the wedding night, which is still a little bit of a mystery to me. <laughs> she couldn't have noticed before. But she wakes up it's and awkward. finds that it's... <laughs> <laughs> and finds that it's, that it's not Paolo she's in bed with, with Gianciotto. And uh, she uh, tries to, you know, suppress her love and tries to be faithful. But in the end, of course, she, she falls in love again. I mean, they see each other again and they kiss and it's very romantic. But they get killed. Ah, yes. So. It is an opera indeed. <laughs> so how would you characterize Zandonai's lush music? Well, lush, that's a very yeah. good word. It's amazing. It's like somebody said it's like... Uh, car crash between Corn Gold and Strauss and Puccini. It's it it has fantastic. I'd moments. love to be the police yeah. officer working <laughs> that car crash. <laughs> so, what made you first want to sing this role? How were you first introduced to it? Well, actually, when I was very young, I was always reading about the old divas in Italy in the beautiful book by Lanfranco Rasponi, the last prima donnas, and one of them was Iris Adami Coradetti who I had the great pleasure of meeting, and I studied with her for a little bit, and she was always talking about Francesca and what a beautiful score it was, and that got me so interested in this oh, style of music. Absolutely, that's so wonderful. You, now, you sang it the first time in Monte Carlo yes. uh, last year. And yeah. Did that help you prepare for, for your experience here yeah, at the of Met? Of course, of course. It was a very different production. It wasn't traditional, and also they cut out loads and loads of music, so I had to learn a lot of extra music, and and now I'm really playing the story as it's, you know, written. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much, Ava. Thank you. So wonderful Eric. to see you. Okay.